it comes to learning math, there is nothing more important than understanding place value. Place value is critical to understanding numbers. Before you can move on to more difficult math problems, you must first learn about ones, tens, and hundreds. There are many more columns, but you'll learn about those in other grades. Here are cubes. Each cube represents one. If you had five cubes, you would have five ones. Here are eight ones. Like many countries, we have a base 10 system, which means that we base our numbers off of groups of 10. 10 ones equals one 10. 10 tens equals 100. We group numbers this way so that it is easier to count and write numbers. Instead of using 12 ones cubes, we group together 10 and use a tens block. We leave the two left of our blocks as ones cubes. This is much easier to count. When we write the number, we write a two in the ones column and a one in the tens, just like this. Let's practice a few more difficult numbers. 48. There are four tens and eight ones. The four does not represent four cubes. It represents four groups of 10. Let's count. 10, 20, 30, 40. The eight represents eight cubes. This time let's look at the base 10 blocks and practice writing the number. There are three tens, 10, 20, 30, and three ones. 33. Now let's look at the number 86. There's an eight in the tens column. Eight tens represents the number 80. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. There's a six in the ones column. So I'll lay out six ones. That's 86. Just like you group 10 ones to create 110, you group 10 tens to make 100. Watch as I gather blocks to create the number 127. I will use 100 block, two tens, and seven ones. One hundred twenty-seven. Ready for a challenge? Now it's your turn. Count the base tens blocks to determine the value. Press pause to think it over. There are three hundreds, four tens, and five ones. One hundred, two hundred, three hundred. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty. One, two, three, four, five. 345. 345. My students like to practice place value by playing race to 100. You start the game by gathering base 10 blocks and a die. Roll the die and add the number in ones blocks. When you get 10 or more ones, trade them up for tens. When you eventually get 10 tens, trade them for 100 and you have finished the game. To play or practice place value on your own, print off the base 10 game pieces from the first link below. Place value is very important to understanding both small and large numbers. Check out the game links below and play Race to 100 for more practice. Have fun!